And I tell you all about it when I see you again. When I see you again. Wow, discovered a little talent there, I think. I got a fish just pound town. Clinch Outdoors is brought to you by Drexel Building Supply. Supplying happiness since 1985. Missed you. Oh, a doubler. How you doing? Who is that? I don't know. Do I know you? No, you don't. How do you know? Because I don't know you. Are you from Watoma? No, I'm not. Where are you from? Berlin. Oh. Are they, are they biting? Nope, nothing yet. We're How seeing them, but we're not. Here? What? How long you been here? An hour. Oh, okay. They're not biting yet. I don't know what's going on. Bill, gotta move. Yeah. It's not fun to What? Are you marking any? Uh, a couple, yeah. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are filming a little bluegill episode. We're targeting the monsters. Um, pretty good spot here. Marking a lot of fish. Got a couple in the bag already. A couple over nine. But yeah, stay tuned. Let's see what happens. So believe it or not, um, we're using jigging wraps for these bluegills. Um, eighth ounce. It's actually a different, different setup than what you're probably used to. But since they're deep and they're sometimes finicky, we're using bigger baits to sort through them little ones. And uh, yeah, jigging wraps are the move. Wow, nice fish. Woo! That one's going to be pushing 10. Nine What's that? Let me see one of those nine inchers. Oh, we were just messing around. We're making videos in here. You do, what do you got? Anything? Yeah, we got some. Can I see them? Uh, if you stick your head through this door in here. Here. Right here? Really? Right there, yep. You are catching fish. Oh, yeah. What Better the hell? We got one stupid bass. Really? Yeah. Oh, sh yeah, these, I don't know, this lake can be tough. Yeah, they do well in the summer. They mm -hmm. live just down the road from here. Oh, okay, I gotcha. But he, he said there ain't shit for bluegills. Yeah. You got some. Yeah, you gotta just sort through it. He said he caught two eights out here. But oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, they'll, they call me. You just gotta wait them out. What, are you fishing right on bottom? Mm-hmm. What color? Uh, greens. Green, yeah. I, we, I fish up by Lake Tomahawk. We got a place up by Lake Tomahawk. Mm-hmm. And uh, it's not boring at all. Yeah, I bet. <clears throat> it's a good spot up there. Yeah, constant fish all the time. Hey, thanks for letting me see him. Yeah, no problem. Good luck. Yeah, we're, we're probably going to quit for soon. All right. Pulled up, made my appearance. You can't sit with us without clearance. That lame shit, never let it near us. And your girl will choose my team because you still living with your parents. Flexing on the gram with your paycheck. Stop showing off them bills you ain't paid yet. Couture 101. Hello there. Got another nice bluegill there. Are you guys liking the video? <laughs> Bryce and Tyler are here. <laughs> Hello? Open up. What are you guys doing here? Hello. Hello. Hey. Did you make it out here? Barely. Did you almost die? Oh, that's freezing. I'll just pop you some holes and just... That's what your boys did, Jared. What'd your boys do? We forgot, uh... Forgot chairs. Chairs. You forgot chairs? Yep. Don't worry, though. We got pails. We have but two buckets, though. Buckets always work. Dude, look at that one. Look at those two. That one's freaking huge. It's like a nine-incher. You know what I mean? That's a big motor sharker. Well, they're coming through. I mean, there's pretty decent schools. I'm not gonna lie, but it's like a lot of them don't bite. You know? I've only caught like four or five, but I'm marking a whole bunch. It's just a matter of getting ones that want to bite. Not gonna lie, I didn't remember my uh, graph, so I brought you another graph. Did you really? They're right here? No, that's a camera. Yeah, the blue case behind there is actually graph. You're welcome, dude. That was clutch. Dude. Yeah. Well, I just know you, so I just we have dues. I plan to add. Do's, combos, waters, gonna, gatorades. Bryce, if you're gonna be here, I'm gonna put yours here. 
<laughs> There's gonna be three jigs in one little circle down there. That's kind of funny if you think about it. This is my 56th time this year. 56? Yep. Six milli? Six freaking millions. <laughs> There's fish down there. Just kind of set your little tushy up and just start jigging your little tush tush. Oh, wooshy pushy. GoPro, start recording. Well, guys, as you can see, Bryce and Tyler showed up. Uh, I got here probably about an hour ago. Um, started fishing, caught four or five gills. Some nice ones here. And uh, we're going to try to pluck some bluegills today, maybe set some tip-ups out. But I set the big shelter up, so we're just kind of hanging out in here. But see what happens. There we go guys, first fish on camera of the day, got adding this one to live, oh, this is the third one, I'm going to keep some fish today, not like a full limit or anything, we'll maybe just keep 5 or 10 fish, eat some up, but we're marking, we're marking quite a few fish, just got to get the right ones to take it. Disney World is building their own like, neighborhoods around the park now. I saw it at the gas pump the other day. Like actual houses? They're building like for workers. Like they want to, it's like a Disney themed neighborhood. It's like, uh, like houses. Yeah, for places, people to live and stuff. Like, like for their workers. You know, because they have so many workers. It's, some of them can't afford to live anywhere down there. It's so yeah. expensive. Well, the only place they can afford land down there is to live. So they're building like, it was like a, it was like a flyover, you know, a virtual flyover yeah. of what it's going to look like. It was literally like a bunch of houses surrounding the park. Surrounding the park. Yeah, yeah Cheddar News. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> yeah, you thought you were going to be playing games with me, huh? Like, so, he's like, what? He's like, <laughs> we got a flag, boy. <laughs> Just get him right. <laughs> Yeah. Is there a fish? <laughs> oh, this is awesome, buddy. I'm trying to get where the freaking shadow's not in the way. We saw a bass or what? Is it? <laughs> Look at that old snot rocket. Good job, buddy. <laughs> First one on tip up. Why don't you kill him and hold him up for the cam bam? Pretty old northern pike. Good job, Bryce. We had like three flags at once, right? And then we got this one. This one was spinning like friggin' Juju train, though. No. Actually, wait, I thought you said you had three. Oh, wow. What the heck? When I first found this spot early, this early ice, it was all big ones. Like, like you didn't catch, you didn't catch small ones. Like when I had Jackson out here, mm -hmm. it was all eight inches. Now it's. Like this kind of stuff. Like you wouldn't, you wouldn't really catch that before it was all quality. Okay. Oh. Ah! <laughs> people love it, dude. I mean, he's getting, you know, a couple thousand people are watching it and commenting. And oh, we got a fish coming, coming to me. Nice. One. Like legit. It's legit. That's a good deal right there, though. That's a nice movie right there, for sure. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm a good eater, but I don't know, man. Kind of small. Could you imagine being a bluegill, though, and seeing it? Tiny, this thing. No, he's, he's decent. He might be a maybe keeper. It's, maybe he's coming up. He might be a keeper. Oh, I still got one on me, I think. Oh yeah, dude. Horrible. Perfect. Oh, chunk. Perfect keeper. Dude, he swallowed it. Oh. oh, I got a nice one right there. He was chasing. That was. Do you think he was the same fish or a different one? I don't know. That one. We had one chasing like up and down, up and down. One bite. And another one came in. So. I just want to show you guys. This was a nicer one from earlier. It was the second fish we caught. Well, this was before they showed up, but it was a nice deal. Probably pushing nine inches. Two studs. Alright guys, we hooked up. This is a 
this is a tank right here. I knew it was big just by the marks. There two came in together. And I missed them the first time. It's a good eater. That's a nice That's kill. Big. <clears throat> two came in together. It seems like the nicer ones will stay together, which I found this winter, but that's a really nice eater. Perfect go. Probably eight inch. Hey, what was one? Like, finicky cooler, little one. Just, just be a line, that's a lot of fun. Nothing crazy, but perfect hook placement. Nope, I don't. Walk well, pretty good. Nice little pike. Pretty fish. And they put up good fights too. Send him back on his way. Like, really? It's the closest one. Is it spinning? Not spinning. Right. I'll go get it. Okay. If you if you hook into it, let me know. Really? I just got something on this step up. Oh. <laughs> a little largey. Right, let's go buff. That's good. I, we wanted to see a bass. That's good. Oh, okay. Yeah, and they're, they're pretty fish too. You know? Yeah. Cool. Pretty fish. Wow. Good deal. Okay. The sad time has come. Where are you going? Basketball? Yep. Okay. Is that, that's more important than fishing, right? Going to get buckets. Yes, sir. Got to go get uh, heated up for that big steak game, right? Yep. You got to go to basketball too? Yeah. Why? Because you have to do it with Tyler? Because they have to take Tyler home? Yeah. Uh... Dude, did you do that? No. Unbelievable. Okay. It's been a long day without you, my friend. Don't leave me. Don't leave me, Blake. Don't leave me. Okay, see ya. Have a nice day. Hey, guys. Hey, thanks. All right, guys, well, my friends left, and I'm sad now because I have this huge, huge space with no one to fill it. So uh, basically, I'm going to keep jigging in my spot. I got a nice spot sitting here. I'm going to get that camera set up so you got a little different angle. And uh, it's only 2.40 p.m. right now. Uh, it doesn't get dark till like 5.30 here. So I would say the bite will start pretty good in about an hour. But... We got some time to kill here. I got a couple tip-ups out we'll keep an eye on, but otherwise, I'm just chilling like a villain. Just chilling by myself in here. Um, comfortable as can be. Got the heater down there. Got some food and drinks here, and I got the camera. I got you guys, so. Bryce and Tyler got to go to basketball, I guess, which is understandable. But, I mean, it makes me sad when my buddies leave me, you know? I'll be, I'll be all right. I'll make her through it. Just a little guy. Yep. Just a little tiny one. I don't think it's that big. <clears throat> nope. <clears throat> Unreal. We got a flag, guys. I literally heard it. I heard it go up. Let's see what we got going on. He's running with it. There's the weight. Come on, be something good. Ooh. There's some weight there. Literally, I was just waiting for this moment because this when the sun came over the trees, or the sun's going down. And it seems like when the sun goes out, tip ups come pop up. And uh, I was sitting there and I just heard thunk. And there's some decent weight here. Oh, it is a pike. <laughs> Little snot rocket. Keepers, creepers, guy. Just give up already. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Pull this and that. Little pikerooskies right there. <laughs> Finicky fooler. Sun just kind of poked out of the clouds. Boom. Up, up popped the fooler. Good old pike. Perfect. Hooked it right in, right in the top lip there. Didn't get by the teeth, perfect. Not a very big one, but pretty. Pretty and healthy, so that's good. Keep gotta keep gotta let them keep growing. I 
Hello there. Got another nice bluegill there. <laughs> it's gonna taste great. Feels decent. He's going back. Not quite big enough. All right, guys. I uh, it's getting dark out, and I've been fishing for 11 hours straight, and I got a lot of stuff to pick up, and I'm just sick of fishing. So we're gonna call it a night, and uh, start putting some stuff away and head her home and eat something because I've been eating a bag of combos all day. That's about all I had, and a donut from Quick Trip. That's right. I forgot about that. But um. Yeah, it was a fun day. I had the boys out here, um, set up the big old freaking otter shack. It's ginormous, big old gino. Um, and I had a great time. Had some tip-ups, uh, caught a bunch of gills, and just had a very, very nice time out here on the ice. It was a beautiful day. The wind was not too bad. It died down, actually, as the day went on, the wind got better. Um, so, yeah, it was a great time with Bryce and Tyler. Um, wish we could have had a chase out here, Misty Buddy. But, uh... He'll be out here next time with us. So, thanks for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe and like if you uh, like the content, as they say. And uh, we'll catch you in the next Clinch Outdoors video. Peace out.